love a chia pudding. And today I'm going to show you a really nice creamy coconut chia pudding using some coconut milk, which means it's dairy free, but still really delicious. So this is actually a really lovely coconut milk and it's got a slightly gray color, which simply means that it's unbleached. So it really is just good quality coconut milk. And I'm going to add some flavor to this with some cinnamon. I've got some vanilla extract and also some honey, just to give us a little bit of sweetness. Now, the thing I love about this is this chia pudding could be dessert for your lactose intolerant or dairy-free friends, or it could be breakfast. So let's combine these ingredients in the bowl just to make sure that coconut milk gets mixed together with the cinnamon, the honey, and now I'm going to add my chia seeds. And goodness me, that is starting to smell really good in the bowl. So I've got these chia seeds here. And these are great. They're really high in fibre, which is great for heart disease and bowel cancer risk, but also high in omega-3 fatty acids, which are the good fats that you want in your diet. So really good for heart health. Now let's mix that together. And I've got these lovely little jars here. If you're doing this for dessert, then you can present these really nicely in a jar. And all I'm going to do is fill up these jars, pop them in the fridge overnight if you've got time or four to five hours, and then they're ready to go. So these have set beautifully in the fridge. You can see now that they're quite solid, ready to eat. I like to top these with just a little bit of extra strawberry and some coconut, some toasted coconut, just a little bit there on the side. And my goodness, that is a fantastic dessert or breakfast. You've got that beautiful creamy coconut milk through there. Anyone can enjoy it, even if you're dairy free. I hope you like this one at home.